Um, we got this interesting clip again, courtesy of the Friday Kids subreddit, featuring Brian Callan's Instagram story, where he's having some banter with Steven Crowder. And again, I don't really know Steven Crowder too tough, right? I don't know him that well. I don't know his content too well. I've, I know he did that kind of, what's that thing called? Um, those debates where he sits on the table. I've watched a few of those here and there, but I don't really know his personality too well. So I don't know if this is banter or if this is him actually annoyed, but trying to make it seem like it's banter. What do you think? I'd love to know your opinions in the chat. About to go live here? No, no, they, they, they should send you. Okay. So that way you'll need to hit a button. And like cross I know, but I'm trying to do promotion right now. Steven. What? Let's go live. Let's make this the best show ever. Is this already live? No, but I'm... You have no idea what I could have been doing and that camera's turned on? Well, yeah, but That's the way... That's why you get in trouble, Brian. But you, you move That's like... That's why a, you get in trouble. You move like a jungle cat. About to go yeah, live here, guys. This is how we do it. Is there a way to make me less narrow and less gray? The sweater is really bringing out my... age. What do you think that is about? Was that Was that real? Was that humor? Was Crowder just being playing into the bit? Like, what's happened there? That was a bit awkward, bro. Like, yikes. <laughs> like, what's going on there? Was he actually annoyed? Was that real? I don't know. Crowder's a bit dry. I know his, his humor could be a little bit on the darker side. I don't know. Like, again, I, don't, I haven't watched enough of Crowder to judge his character. But do you think that's actually him annoyed? Or do you think he's pretending not to be annoyed and joking? I don't know. I don't know how to read that one, man. I don't know how to read that one. People say, okay, Crowder was not wrong either. Pathetic, it was real. Crowder saying it's a bit. Crowder is less, even less funny than Brendan. Annoyed boss tone. Exactly, that's what I thought, Ultimo. That's why you get fired. It's 100% truth warning. Alan N, exactly. Crowder recreated George Floyd's death. Yeah, I know he did. I saw that. Um, pretty accurate, to be fair. Woo. Um, <laughs> Natasha Ski, yep. James Banks, he was annoyed for sure. Uche, don't record me without telling me that's a weird way to move. Yeah, it's a good <laughs> Crowder wants to control the narrative at all times. Yo, man. Imagine imagine getting fired at 60 years of age from the louder and crowder. Imagine how embarrassing that would be to get fired at 60 years of age. When you're Brian Callen from Loud from Louder with Crowder because you didn't know how to behave on set. Because you you know, you was addicted to your fucking smartphone, like as if you're some Gen Z pop star or something. Imagine an old man getting fired from uh Louder with Crowder because they can't put down their fucking iPhone. <laughs> people are saying it's real. Okay, everyone's saying it's real. Wow, people are saying it's real. Jesus Christos, man. What a bizarre interaction there from two supposed colleagues getting to know each other um employee and boss new hire first week at work or so second week at work bedding in process like god damn it man crowder really like let him know hey this is why you get fired this is why you have people making allegations in the los angeles times <laughs> you don't pay attention to the details <laughs> holy shit Callan man what are you doing Callan what are you doing what are you doing here